The objective of this lab is to verify Newton's second law, sum of the forces equals mass times acceleration, and to measure acceleration due to gravity, g. The materials used in this lab are one cart, one pulley, one string, masses ranging from 0.2 kilograms to 1 kilograms, a stopwatch, meter stick, and a scale, its spring or another type. Setup. A cart of mass M cart with an added mass M on a table is connected by a string to a mass M hang, which is hanging over a pulley that is fixed to the edge of the table. The length of the string, X, is just long enough for the hanging mass to touch the floor when the cart touches the pulley. A diagram of the lab setup can be seen here. A free body diagram of the cart can be seen here. A free body diagram of the hanging mass can be seen here. A mathematical evaluation of Newton's second law regarding the free body diagram can be seen adjacent to the free body diagram pictured. An evaluation of Newton's second law equation regarding the hanging mass can be seen adjacent to the free body diagram. A derivation of acceleration can be seen here. Please enjoy this demonstration of the lab. Procedure 1. In preparation, weigh the cart, then determine its mass. An experimental value could be 0.2 kilograms. Enter this in column 1. 2. Hang a mass 10 or 20 grams on the end of the string. Record this value of the hanging mass, m hang, which we found to be 0 0.02 kilograms, and enter this in column 2. And 3. Measure the distance that the cart travels, which x for this experiment is 0.6 meters, this should be the same as the distance from the floor to the top of the table. Enter this in column 9. In preparation, step 2. For each of the following five masses, m is equal to 0 0.2, 0 0.3, 0 0.5, 0 0.7, and 1 kilograms. Put the mass in the cart. Then, pull the cart back until the hanging mass just touches the pulley. And 3. Let go of the cart and time how long it takes for the cart to reach the pulley. Do this three times. Enter this in time T1, T2, and T3. The application question should be answered as a class. Thank you for your participation in this online lab. See you next time.